What's going on? I'm BMP. Welcome to the channel. Welcome to my new segment called Let's Catch Up on G Fuel Reviews because I was gone for a month moving and all my stuff was in Virginia and I was back in PA. So it's a mystery G Fuel unboxing. It's going to be a surprise for me, but you're going to know because you already seen the thumbnail. So let's grab a box, unbox it, and see what G Fuel flavor we're going to try today. Okay? <laughs> We'll get this big boy right here. Looks like it's gonna be a good one, nice collector bundle. I right, got the flavor I'm gonna be unboxing is going to be pink drip. There we go. Apparently they have bubble wrap on the cup. That's interesting. Did anyone else just come with bubble wrap on it? I don't know. All right, let's open this. This is really a cup that came with this? Like a guess, maybe it is. I don't know. It's like a pink. I guess it's a bubblegum corally pink flavor. I don't know, I thought it was supposed to be pinker than that. Has to be the right cup, right? Yeah, it's definitely the right cup. Has to be. Oh, and the clasp is like a very, very light, light pink. It's not white. I thought it was white. And then the inside is going to match the lid. That's going to be that salmon-y, like, pink color. Here's the sticker that comes with the Pink Drip collab. Definitely pretty good. And here you guys have it, the tub for Pink Drip. It looks pretty good. It reminds me of Pink Floyd, breaking the wall type vibes with some pinks thrown in there, some yellows. I don't know. It just kind of gives some Pink Floyd vibes on this. I know I'm probably going to do a lot of hate for that in the comments, but that's okay. I I'm not hating the tub. It's, it's very interesting. It's not a tub I absolutely love, but it's definitely not a tub that I hate. So let's crack it open, see what we got to work with here. All right, going out of character a little bit with G Fuel's normal color powder, we got this Pink, light pink, off white, pinkish. Let's go give this a little whiffy whiff. It reminds me of like icing. It's kind of like something sweet, like a kind of like cupcake or icing or something like that. I don't know if I'm gonna dig this chat. I'm not, you guys know I'm not a huge fan of like the candy stuff like that. I'm nervous, a little nervy worby. All right guys, let's pour this in here. Of course, do me a solid. Put ice in your cup. You guys want to enjoy G Fuel. So put ice in your cup. It's gonna be super chilly cold. You're gonna love it. You're gonna love life. So just listen to me, all right? And of course, you guys already know, fill it to there, not up here. If you really wanna be crazy and not use ice and fill it way up to here, then fine, that's on you. Don't come complaining to me when you did not have a party in your mouth because you're not gonna. I'll just tell you right now. Fill it to here, not up there, and you will be thanking me and like, Okay, so give it a little shaky shake. Oh, I did not expect this to be this color at all. I expected this to be like a super vibrant pink. What was I wrong? All right, guys, it's like a kind of like the Phase X, but with a pink. But yeah, definitely like an off-white, like frosty white with a pink hue to it. I guess that's fitting for pink drip. I expected it to be a lot more pink, but like, whoa, pink, not... Oh, I see the pink. All right, let's open it and smell it. I smell something like sweet, almost kind of like a very, very faint like sweet tart, but I don't think that's what we're getting, fam. I don't know, it's very, it's a very light smell, but you can definitely tell that it's something like sweet. But it does remind me of like a Phase X smell, honestly, if we're gonna be real here. Like on those lines, does, it doesn't smell exactly like Phase X, so don't get excited if you're a Phase X fan like me, cause it's just has Phase X vibes, just, just the smell alone. All right, check it out one more time, and then I'll give this a little tasty taste. All right, here we go. Let's go and try G Fuel's Pink Drip, and let's see how it tastes. What is this? I'm getting a whole lot of things in here, chat. Oh, what? What is that? Okay, I'm gonna break it down with everything that I've tasted along the journey. Okay, so. One, I think it does have kind of a candy-esque vibe, but, but not a super strong. It's a very, very light flavor in overall, in my opinion. I think it's a light flavor, not, has candy vibes, but I don't think it's solely candy popping in your mouth flavor. Number two, 
A few of the sips, I got a like a, the pink lemonade vibe mixed with something kind of sweeter than lemonade, like a candy thing. So there could be like the pink lemonade vibe going on here with like candy, like lemonade meets candy, you know what I mean? And then, and then I get like a, you know those like party marshmallows? They're like pink and green marshmallows. I kind of have a light flavoring of that. But I'm gonna have to go with my gut since there's yellow on the thing. Cause why would they throw yellow in pink drip? Like in the packaging and stuff. I feel like lemonade has to be somewhat of a component to this. But it still has that candy kind of vibe. But not a very overwhelming, super sweet candy vibe. But I think it's kind of light. Definitely lemonade with something sweeter along the line. But not so sweet it's not gonna be like it's not it's not let's put it this way you guys know i don't care for the candy flavored jeels this isn't terrible i could sip on this is it gonna be one of my favorite flavors no is it gonna be in my rotation yeah pretty much but it's one that i can sip on so take that how you want to take it you guys know i don't really mess with the candy flavored g fuels like strawberry shortcake no, no good, no bueno, no way. But this I could definitely get on board with. It's a, a light, it's a very light flavor. It's a very light candy flavor, I should say. And I feel like lemonade somewhat is thrown in there. It's not overwhelming. You're not gonna drink it right away and be like, oh my gosh, lemonade's gonna be in this. Like you saw, it took me a few moments to like gather my thoughts of what was going on in my mouth. So it's not terrible. I'm uh, I'm not gonna hate it. I'm gonna throw it around in the rotation a little bit. Not super heavy, but enough that I'm gonna definitely throw my taste buds off when I when I take a little sippy sip of this. I'm gonna rate this probably a seven, six point eight to seven out of ten. It's not terrible if you guys are a fan of kind of lemonade vibes. You might want to give this a try. If you are a fan of the candy-esque vibes, you might want to give this a try. It's not going to be super sweet and bam, in your mouth. It's going to be a light, more refreshing vibe, in my opinion. So if that's something that you think you can get on board with, definitely try it out. Other than that, I don't, I don't want to say go but get a tub and try for yourself because this is such a bizarre flavor to me. Because it's like lemonade and candy and it's super light tasting and it's not super sour, not super sweet. So I don't want to, I don't want you guys to like get it and then hate it and waste all their money on a tub. So you might, if this is a flavor that you think you could wait to try, then wait till they release it in packets if they haven't already, but probably not. They're pretty slow on that. All right, guys, that is pretty much it for me. 6.8 to 7 out of 10. Has some lemonade vibes to it. Very light lemonade vibes. And some type of like a candy vibe, but it's not super sweet, over the top. It's very light, refreshing, definitely a different G Fuel flavor. If you have tried Pink Drip, please put down in the comments down below what you think it tastes like so you can help everyone else out that stumbles across this and maybe on the fence on deciding, do I want to pick up Pink Drip? Do I not want to pick up Pink Drip? Help some people out. All right, guys, that is it for me. As always, guys, I would love to hang out with you guys over on our Twitch. Link will be in the description down below, twitch.tv slash bmp underscore 89. Guys, we will be streaming a lot more regularly than we have. Like I said, I'm still under construction, setting everything up on the move. And once we get everything finalized, more streams will become more ripped more available, but we're generally live over there Monday through Friday around the 6, 7 p.m. Eastern time. As always, guys, we usually post when we're live over on Twitch, so follow our Twitch. Link is down in the description below so you guys don't miss anything. And of course, if you enjoyed the video, please consider giving it a like. And if you're new, consider subscribing and hitting the bell so you guys know we put out new videos because there's going to be a ton of them because I've missed like seven G Fuel releases, so I got a lot of catching up to do. Plus, I got lots of other ideas, videos coming up, so you're not going to miss it. The bell. All right, guys, that is it for me. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Other than that, go outside. It's starting to get warm over here in the state. So go outside, enjoy it, tell someone you love them, stay safe, and of course, I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye.